If you're dealing with compaction, with salinity, high pH, poor infiltration, that's a symptom of a dysfunctional soil. Soil health is a root cause on how you fix it. My name is Rudy Garcia. I work with the NRCS Soil Health Division. And in the last three days, here I've been uh, with Dr. Oz Klute. We had the privilege of seeing uh, very dynamic, passionate folks that have, have really stepped out to try to understand how to comprehend how does soil health apply in the Southwest with long growing seasons, with drought, windy conditions, soils with high pH, calcareous soils, you know, irrigation systems, and uh, can you make it work? We met three amazing producers in Brendan Rocky in Colorado, growing potatoes, the Lescones here near Lordsburg on our largest vineyards. And we also met with Brian Driscoll on one of the largest pecan orchards in the United States. And they, they understand the, the ecological principles of soil health, and they understand how to monitor it and assess it, and more importantly, the folks that understand that you gotta see the whole picture ecologically based. So if you're dealing with compaction, with salinity, high pH, poor infiltration, that's a symptom of a dysfunctional soil. And they understand that, and when they see that problem, they say that the reason that's a problem, it's a symptom of something that went wrong, but a soil health is a root cause on how you fix it. Soil health principles can work anywhere, and it can benefit and help so many people in, on a lot of the real issues that we're facing.